almost Lunar New Year. What are you most looking forward to? Money and of course tons of food. Welcome to Fantastic Studio on Nan Nan Kitchen. Hey everyone! Today Owen and I will be showing you how to create your very own custom Chinese candy box. A Chinese candy box is used during the Lunar New Year. Today we will be preparing five different snacks. First up, sesame chips. Mix the egg white and caster sugar until the sugar is completely dissolved and the egg white is foamy. Now we can add the flour and melted butter and whisk it. Next, we'll use a spoon to make one inch wide circles. And then we'll spread it out to two inches wide. Now, bake in the beets. And remove the outer skin and slice them with a cucumber slicer into thin slices. It's really soft. That's a lot easier. And once the color has changed, we can remove it and it will be crispy when cool. Our third snack, dry fruits. We'll slice the fruits. Um, take that for the left here. Slicing the apples is very satisfying. It feels nice. We'll remove the moisture from the fruits using a dehydrator. This will help to make it crispy. Matcha fudge! We'll whisk together condensed milk and matcha powder over medium heat, pour in white chocolate, and wait until the chocolate has completely melted. Milking really fast. Yeah, it looks really fudgy already. Then we'll pour the mixture in the baking dish. But now we use our fifth snack, sea salt caramels. We'll add heavy cream and butter into a saucepan and roll over low heat until the butter is melted. In a separate pot, add water and then corn syrup. Then add sugar. Cover the lid for one minute. Then check the temperature to see if it has reached 320 degrees Fahrenheit. Pour the butter and cream mixture into the pot. Continue rolling for a little while. Sprinkle some salt over the caramel. Chinese candy box with your friends and family. And to celebrate the new year, we have a ton of movies waiting for you at 8 p.m. I'm Shirley. And I'm Owen. We, we wish you a prosperous Lunar New Year. year.